What's up, you guys? Sean Ross Sapp here with a name you know, the greatest wrestling news source in the world, <laughs> Chelsea Green. Oh Chelsea, my how gosh. you doing? I'm so good. Thanks for having Man, me. This is a big event. We're at WrestleCade right now. Not to date this, but uh, you've been you've been a busy girl. Yeah, it's been crazy. I mean, I really was nervous when I was released, um, and I feel like this has been my best year yet. Like, there was no reason to be nervous, but I was nervous with the release, with COVID, with everything. But, yeah, 2021 has been good. I don't know how 2022 is going to top it. So, Impact, ROH, from what I heard, you were supposed to maybe do some AAA stuff. Yep. That didn't end up happening. What happened there? So, I was supposed to, um, but our timeline just didn't really line up. And um, Deanna was going. I was possibly going to go with her uh, for, you know, Triple Mania, which would have been amazing. But, yeah, we haven't been able to kind of line things up and I mean I, I've been busy <laughs> you have been busy uh, unfortunately one of those busy things ROH announced Ugh. that they'd be taking the first quarter off yeah you've had taping since then so sort of walk me through like how you found out about that I heard about a zoom call were you a part of that because I know you weren't technically signed to the company yeah but you're still working lots of dates doing commentary and stuff so I actually wasn't part of the zoom call so it came as a shock to me a lot of us found out the same way you all did which was um, you know on Twitter yeah. and it didn't bug me because I am not contracted so I, I don't think that they owe me anything but I was just so sad to hear about that and then I thought it was really interesting because they let us know and then not weeks later we had tapings and everyone was thinking I was trolling um, <laughs> Twitter posting photos at yeah tapings. yeah at, and I was absolutely not we are at tapings we are still taping until um, the end of the year and some actually I think there's a couple episodes past the end of the year and into 2022 so um the the vibe at tapings was really positive i think everyone is just kind of excited to be together and be around each other and be hanging out for what could be the last time in theory you know were there like exchanges of like who have you reached out to were you going after this anything like that no absolutely i think everyone was just being really really upfront and honest and transparent about these are my options and what are yours and what are some good contacts that you have that i don't i feel like we all should be sharing that information oh well speaking God. of why are you talking honesty to and transparency oh, well it's God. definitely not gail kim <laughs> She's here to put over the younger talent. Yeah. Sean Ross. Sa spoilers, dude. Uh, listen, listen. That's why we have a beat. Listen, <laughs> if if you don't want me to spoil all this, yeah. tell her to stop telling me everything. <laughs> yeah, I'm didn't you know? She I'm is the, the number top wrestling source. news source. Are you now? That's what Twitter listen, thinks. <laughs> do you want to tell me <laughs> right now says. who who you have signed Impact Wrestling? Any no, I don't. Any confirmation? Any spoilers? No. Any? No. any? Paparazzi's putting pressure on you. Well, it's going to be good 2022. That's all oh, I got. It's going to be Are so Are you signing good. me? Here, am I Green. Am I getting signed? Oh, I don't know about that. You are, <laughs> what do you have to offer? Um, wit, humor, scoops. To do yeah, nobody in, nobody will tell. tell everybody who you're signing anymore besides me. Why? Are you the only one that finds out the dirt? Pretty much. Yeah. Really? He's Pretty gonna, much. He gets <laughs> Unless the dirt Scott and then he spreads the love. Unless Scott leaks it to Mike Johnson. <laughs> what? Oh. I'm just Wait, what? Unless Scott are you the calling mic Scott Demora stooge? Yeah, of course. I never said it. He said it. I mean, this is this is this is how it's going. But Chelsea's now. your stooge. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's what Twitter. That's, that's, that's what Twitter says. That's what Twitter says. So, <laughs> this is my offer. You become my new stooge. We end our beef. We end our feud. I can't do that. Did you ever look I at? I don't believe in spoilers. Okay. I believe in the fans. Having genuine, reactions. authentic reactions. Yeah. Okay, so full disclosure. Although I will say one thing that What's I did find out that you did know Thunder Rosa was the opponent for Deanna at Slam yes, I did. And you didn't leak it. Correct. So I'll give you props for that one. You know what? You A go. lot of times I feel like you know so much and you're really good at withholding. Oh, okay. Like I, I actually do think that because he knows more than I know. He knows more than I know. Yeah. That's for sure. He's got some intel that we don't. So we got to find out who his main. A bunch of unsurprised people watching this. <laughs> a bunch of un thousands of unsurprised people. So full disclosure, we were going to have an interview. We'll just make this our interview right yeah, here. Yeah. I know you're on a tight schedule. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> no. did you ever watch the video of me doing the eat defeat? No, I did not. You I never didn't it's either. Sitting, it's, it's sitting in your inbox. You sent it to me? Mm. Let's see. Let's see if I can pull it up. 
I right, did now, not see that. You were on a plane this. or something. Oh, then I wouldn't have gotten it. Let's see. We're going to have you review my eat defeat. It was in my first practice match that I ever did. Okay. And I didn't even know you knew how to wrestle. I'm, I, this yeah, is all know, like I, shocking I news trained to me. a little bit back in okay. the day. Let's see. Gail Kim messages me <laughs> so yeah, much so that much. I just got to scroll back so through much. all this. This guy. Oh my gosh. Into my DMs and harasses me. All oh the no! Time. Don't say that. People will believe that. Actually, be like, I will say one thing. We do talk a lot, and so I realized that I'm, you know, I conversate with you on Twitter oh. openly. So I always think. Do Here we go. Think I'm a Here we go. But that's what I'm happens not. with me. Oh, Here's I, yeah. My first practice match. How was great. it? How was it? I that was great. Yeah. Oh, no, Gail's really hard to please, though. She is. She is a tough critic. I was inspired I with two eyes. I will say, ever. because your opponent was a little bit shorter, your leg was bent okay. on the way down. So I didn't like to see that. I'm here for criticism. Yeah, you know what? Like, I stole it from you. I straight up stole it from you. And you didn't really jump into it. I didn't jump into no. it. I couldn't jump into it. I was taller than him. Well, then you shouldn't do the move. Oh, come ah. on, Gail. You should be doing something else. Well, I did. I did, Words the, I did the swinging of DDT. Wisdom from Gail Kim. Okay. Hmm. So, yes. have you ever seen her do the unpretty or backwards? Because it actually looked really good. Backwards? As in so she the did, person's on yes, the back? Yeah. Yes. Yes. There was one time she did it. <laughs> She's the interviewer right now. Yes, <laughs> I did. Gail, it I did good, it though. Wait, by accident. Yeah, in my NXT <laughs> debut match. Oh. Gail, I was so nervous. <laughs> she probably had a broken wrist. It was okay. Yeah, I was so was nervous. Okay. Probably. She's it had it for half yeah, her career. Yeah. It's okay. I've had a broken wrist for 17 years. I've only wrestled for seven. So, oh, yes. No. No. <laughs> this but is true. it looked good. Did you consider adding that to your arsenal like that after it happened? Yeah, I, no, I absolutely did until uh, the next day, and the girl was like, my neck hurts, and I was oh, like, oh, no. <laughs> damn it. Because, <laughs> yeah. like, when I looked at it, I was like, I could tell you were setting up for the unprettier, but I was like, that looked really good. Yeah. yeah, we debated it. We actually spoke about it at NXT. And then I also was like, why, why change something like it's not broken, so don't fix it? I love yeah. a good unprettier. I mean, I want to see that. Oh, it's well, good. I'll show you. Like it's good. It, yeah. But if it hurts someone's neck, I mean, that's the point of wrestling, though, right? <laughs> Do people, like, ask your permission to use Eat Defeat? That's where I saw some it. Some people have, and some people haven't. But they who, should. Who do you remember that asked you for it? Oh. Um, Mia Yim. Oh, that's cool. Um, yeah. <laughs> Mia Yim. <laughs> <laughs> Mia Yim. Do you want to bury that, people who didn't? I don't really know that many people that have used it. I know Enzo's used it. Yeah. Um, I'm sure I asked you personally. I'm pretty sure 10 years ago I dropped I a message. But I never invented it, so... Where'd you pick it up from? My only thing is, from my wrestling school okay. that I trained in Toronto, um, my only thing is, you don't have to ask me necessarily, but I don't like when people don't use it as a finisher. Yeah. Sure. Because that's what's kind of more disrespectful, I think. It's I a good finish. Don't use it as a transition move or like whatever you know use it as a finish then at least it's a really good finish mm. the reason i liked it is because we were doing those practice matches yeah. on a boxing ring yeah. they didn't have to take a flat back bump yeah i did i did but yeah <laughs> i did that yeah. sucked but it's easy to yes. do if you do you're flexible everyone. enough to get yeah your leg up your there your leg straight yeah so has there <laughs> been anybody that you've seen and you've said besides me yeah that's dog shit i mean i haven't Name what? names. No, I've been told through fans, but I like him. Sure. The Enzo did it like crap. Oh, no. Where is he? Yeah. Can you hit him? Yeah, he uh, go hit him with one. I don't know if it's true. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if it's true because I never I saw it like one time yeah. that he did it. So. Yeah. And um, didn't Creed use it too? He did a good I, one. I feel like he did. He I did think you're it. right. I he think you're good. right. And Billy Kay. Oh, sorry. Just... Why am Just, I calling her Billy Kay? They <laughs> struck like, me earlier. Kay, Listen, like, they defended your honor earlier they and did? struck me physically. Oh, they did. Because I was like, Gail is over here, and she's going to put over the younger talent, me, <laughs> the no. fresh talent. They did. They slapped me on the forehead. <laughs> and I, I, I mentioned that, and then I almost called her Billy. Just gave me another one, another yeah, slap I've never in the called forehead. her Billy, though. That's why I was so shocked by myself. Trademark Jessie, lawyers coming after you. She said that she did the eat defeat. Yeah. But she did it opposite foot. She did it a different way, yeah. They're yeah. tall girls, yeah. too. Yeah. So I, I feel like it. for, like, a shorter person. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, indeed. And I'm 5'4", so. Have you ever done one? 
I feel like this whole interview is about eat defeat. Um, no, I haven't done one, but oh god, I feel people coming to get me. I look at, look at, look at. Uh oh. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh oh. Deon, like I see Deanna and Matt coming from You're a mile away. I knew it. Um, I have not done it because I feel like, first of all, I would have to make sure it was oh, perfect no. to do it in yeah. front of Gail. Hello. <laughs> let's, let's keep this rolling long enough to get them on camera. Yeah, again. yeah. Pan so over, yeah, the, pan the stuff over. happens. We gotta go. And Matt Cardona is terrible. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's probably putting us on Patreon. He's not I, oh, I, it will. You're putting, you're making listen, money off. Listen, until next time guys, we're out. Bye.